The government putting measures in place to ensure that illegal shanty towns are a thing of the past. Kishal Adderley talked to government officials on the issue today. Headed to Marsh Harbor, Prime Minister Dr. The Honorable Hubert Minnis is fully aware that the fire at the illegal settlement known as the Mud isn't the first, but the government's committed to making it the last. The determination to block any rebuilding made during an emergency cabinet meeting last night. Foreign Affairs Minister Darren Henfield on two more priorities of the assessment. Uh, phase two of the program would be to complete uh, an assessment of the needs uh, of those persons who were, who were displaced and to see how we're going to move forward in the future. Phase three of the plan uh, will be to comprise and compile a comprehensive approach as to how we deal with unregulated communities in the Bahamas. The mud and Pigeon Pea in Abaco account for 500 homes. Living in shelters now, Attorney General Carl Bethel was sure to clarify any perception of leniency for residents. Meantime, the government says it will fortify its illegal immigration offensive with legislation, clamping down on those who facilitate illegal settlement anywhere in the Bahamas. The fact that we extend humanitarian assistance um, to persons right now should not be taken to mean that in terms of the overall policy of the government that there is any retreat from the commitment of the government to enforce the immigration laws. It's not clear how long residents will be accommodated in shelters, but speaking to the suggestion of rebuilding elsewhere, Bethel retorted, Increased penalties for harboring. Um, um, undocumented uh, persons, um, improve the confiscation powers of the government uh, to confiscate items used to transport undocumented persons either into or out of the country or in the country, and uh, generally speaking to lay a foundation for a civil and legal process by which persons who have no right to be in the Bahamas and who are found here illegally, who are found to have landed irregularly or illegally, or to have remained contrary to the law, for them to be returned to their place of origin. Kishal Adderley, ZNS Network News.